What is happening, people? United Central here, back with another video. Match reaction, Manchester United. I've just, just, I'm sweating out here, you know what I mean? That game was very, very nervous, very, very tense. My United have just about beat Copenhagen. Do you know what? Hats off to you guys. Yeah, any Copenhagen fan that's watching this match reaction right now, any any person around the world, but hats off to you. Got a very, very good team. A defining team. They very, very showed their class and quality. You know what, man? Give it give it up to you guys. Big up to you guys. You've got Keeper, which, oi, listen, I'm going to mention him in a bit. Yo, what a keeper he is. And that kid, Falke, what a, what a player is. But hats off to you. And, you know, be commiserations. And I wish you all the best in the, in the, in the, in the, in the future. But my United have just about, and the quality, to be fair, Sean for my United just about through to the semi-finals of the Europa League thanks to Bruno Fernandes Bruno Fernandes Bruno Magnifico the Portuguese Magnifico I don't care he's our player and I'm going to big it up big him up no matter what even though I thought he had a patchy game in, in, in reality but my United are through just about man. like I said to you that's why I keep emphasising it just about because we dominate the game in terms of our moments in the second half but as a whole I I'm not worried, but I just think we should have been clinical today. We should have been absolutely clinical. We should have wiped these guys aside, man. Let's be honest with you guys, because the amount of chances we had, man. Like, if we do that against Sevilla or, or, or Wolves, yeah, we're, we're going to get punished, man. That's in the first half. Let's speak about the first half, because the first half for me was shocking, man. Players giving the ball away. And then one second didn't look himself. Baye looked. I don't know what he did for that. The, the, the one of the chances where he just almost like gave himself in already. You know what I mean? Standing, stand on your ground. That's the first thing you know as a man, as a as a as a player, you get taught is stand on your feet. And he didn't do that for me. And um, I just look at it. I just thought the first half was shocking. And the second half, I don't know what Oli did yeah, but finally he gave the players a roller kick because they came out in that second half firing. They came out energetic. They came out one touch passing. Very very limited ball ball time, but just keeping the ball moving. And I thought that's what was needed right now. Copenhagen is gonna gonna be sitting back deep so deep so far on the block here. Yeah? And they almost invited to say, right, break us down. And Man United did not do that in, in the first half. Second half they did that brilliantly. I thought, you know what I mean, Fred was giving the ball, interchanged it quickly, but the fans started to get the ball more, Pogba started to find spaces. And I just thought we were more live now. Then Martial. Well, Martial's Martial, mate. I'm telling you now, he's become a complete striker now. And that is very, very a bonus for Man United because we've got a player now who believes he's a number nine now he believes he's a number nine and that's what i've always doubted about martial is he a number nine is he a left player is he what, what kind of what kind of a forward is he you know what i mean and tonight is proven what a man brilliant brilliant strike he is for my United, and how dependent we are on rash and uh, martial for me because he gives us that kind of element where you're thinking wow he bursts into life it's almost like ticks about five players out and you're thinking wow where's this come from you know what i mean and it's just like Oh my god, and I just absolutely loved it today. The way he just came into place, he came into his into his own, and you're thinking, wow, like you know what I mean? Like he, for me, I don't know, but we need to be talking about this guy and, and say to himself, wow, because he's almost as if now he's he's going from strength to strength. You know what I mean? He's he's, he's almost like you're thinking, is he in the game? Then he's in the game. Then he comes out to life. You're thinking, wow, what, what where's this come out of? You know what I mean? And you're just thinking, man. Oh man, he just wanted to continue, and I thought for me, he kind of saved us in that, in that game. For me, I really, really do. I think, he, I think he saved us so much here that we we relied on him too much, and I think that's not going to help us in the long run because we need, we need to, we need to, we need to almost, you know, play as a team and and, and kind of have that kind of. You know, team or where you know Rashford today missing a bit today. Greenwood today had the qualities in there, but you know, I mean, Rash Martial for me carries United up that forward line. He holds up the plate. He gives us kind of a balance there. And I just think today for me it was outstanding today for me, man of man of the match. And yeah, man, I thought Mata came in and was very very good. He, you know, he got the ball quickly. He got the ball quickly moving, and I thought he was a bonus today. But yeah, my United are through, man. My United are through to the semi-finals against either Wolves or Sevilla. And I think, you know what? I'm confident, man. I'm confident with that front three. I am confident because I think in any game, in any world, yeah, we can we can win with that front three. The, the fire, the explosive. Yes, Rashford might have had a poor game today, but he'll have a good game against Sevilla or, or Wolves. You know what I mean? It'll be that kind of performance. And I feel like with the way uh, Bruno Fernandes had a, had a shot off target and the way, and uh, the, what's it called? Um, Greenwood had uh, their posts in the post seven side. I just feel like we've got the quality there to beat these teams, and, and I'm happy, man. But guys, let me know your match reaction. That's been my match reaction. Please subscribe to United Central. We are on road to 20k, guys. So please, please subscribe to the channel. And by the way, tomorrow will be the Straight Jacket podcast. So make sure you tune in. We'll be out at maybe 9 30, 10 o'clock in the evening at UK time. But yeah, man, guys, let me know your man of the match. Like the video, subscribe to United Central, and I'll see you. For the semi-finals of the Europa League, guys. Take care. Bye-bye. Peace.